Welcome or welcome back on Cisco. In this video, we're going to take a look to exponential equation in base e. What do you mean? Equation like this e to the x, for example, equals 10 number 15. How do we solve this equation? Okay, very simple. We're going to use the fact that natural log and exponential equation are inverse function. So we're going to logarithmate both sides of the equation. By doing this, we can use one property of logs which tells us the power property that that exponent is going to go up front right and we have x natural log of e equals natural log of 10 but this natural log of e is nothing else than one right this is one okay so we have x equals natural log of that this is the solution of this problem go ahead and try number up with this solution the simplest form x equals negative natural log of 2 we use two property natural log of 1 equals 0 natural log of e equals 1 yeah if you end up with natural log of 1 half I wouldn't say that is a, a bad solution is a good solution however probably you may want to think about simplifying and having your mind that this one is the same thing with natural log of 1 half Let's take a look to number 17. Again, we have an exponential equation in base e. First thing, we really want to solve for the exponential. And that is the idea for any exponential equation, not only the natural base. So we're going to isolate the e first. And it was pretty easy here. We add 3 on both sides and end up with e to the 2x equals 4. And then we're going to logarithmate both sides. And by now, I hope you see it. We have two x, right? Because natural log of e is one <coughs> equal to natural log of four. Divide by two, and we end up with natural log of four over two. Very important. Leave it like that. Nothing else can be done. Pause this video clip and try number eighteen. Again, if you end up with this solution, x equal natural log of 10 over 3, then you did a wonderful job. If you need to approximate this solution, you need a calculator. Okay, let's take a look to this two example now. In fact, I'm going to do one and you're going to do the other one. The first one says 3 times e to the power 5x minus 2 plus 2 equals 11. So again, the first goal on this exponential equation is to isolate the exponential uh, part of the equation in this case e to the 5x minus 2. So the first thing we're going to subtract 2 Then we're going to divide by 3 All Right, so we can cancel out these 3 and end up with e to the 5x minus 2 equals 3 Then we're going to look at it made both sides Right. And that will give us 5x minus 2, right? 5x minus 2 because natural log and e cancel out. 5x minus 2 
equals natural log of 3. Okay, add 2 on both sides. Okay, 5x equals, I will suggest you to start with 2 here. 2 plus natural log of 3, and then divide by 5. So the solution is 2 plus natural log of 3 over 5. Uh, try to do number 20. If you end up with this solution, x equals negative 7 plus natural log 5 over 3, then you did a wonderful job. If you enjoy this uh, math video clips, don't forget to come back and see square for more math video clips. Thank you.